are you still coming over? I just talked a little Timmy into bed and his father's away on a business trip. Hey Matt, last night was spectacular. I can barely walk. Hit me back as soon as you can. I'd love to see you tonight. Hey Matt, thanks for taking care of my paraplegic daughter. She said she had the time of her life. I'm hoping I can be next. Hey my sweet little munchkin. When are you gonna be a good boy and come up? <laughs> You've been such a good boy. Why don't you let mommy come take care of you? Goo goo gaga. Mommy so hungry. <laughs> For the Wheel of Mutts NFC Championship. Also, the doors are paper thin in this apartment complex. So I'm very sorry to my Japanese neighbors. Konnichiwa. Ni hao, buddy. Oh, my wa mo It's cool, guys. I watch anime. Okay, the NFC Championship. It's Houston Texans season, the wild card playoffs. Honestly, they kind of went how they did for the Houston Texans in real life. We stomped them. It was a defensive masterclass. The only difference to real life is we had Joe Flacco at quarterback. I just now put together how funny that is. Here's our lineup right now. We've got the NFC Championship ahead of us. And honestly, we have an absolutely insane team. There's not too many holes to fill. I'd like to get a better right tackle. 92 Darisaw is a little weird for me right now. Wide receivers are great. I think a backup to Jameer Gibbs would be nice. He's kind of been a one-man army out there. And he's a little undersized. So I think, I don't think a, a backup halfback's a bad idea. Defensively, though, we're still kind of rocking like budget linebackers. Each of these dudes is less than 100,000 coins, maybe right in the ballpark. So I wouldn't mind getting a 95, 96 in those positions. Backup D tackle could still use some work, but overall, I absolutely could compete in the Super Bowl with this exact team and I would be just fine with it, but that's not the spirit of Wheel of Mud. We're definitely going to make the team as good as we can. All right, boys, we only get two wheel spins because this is the playoffs, but it's juice. It's the AFC Championship. This is Texan season, not the NFC. We get a Divisions 94-95. This isn't going to be a huge upgrade, but hopefully we can grab ourselves a linebacker. Yo, shout out Pete Werner. Pete Werner's been amazing. But it, it, it may be time. It may actually be time. We're going to get the NFC South. So we take any single player in the NFC South that's a 94 to 95 overall. Let's start with the Buccaneers. Ryan Neal. Okay, Levante David's actually a really good option. Vita is a good backup. We've already got all style. Okay, Warren Sapp's insane. So Warren Sapp's actually, Warren Sapp's probably the best option right now. Warren Sapp is such a good detail. What about the New Orleans Saints? Chris Olave. Falcons, what do you got for me? You got a punter, you got Michael Vick. And that just leaves the Panthers. I cannot imagine the Panthers are really the team that comes through for me. Yeah, dude, it's so lopsided for the Buccaneers here in the NFC South. I'm gonna pick up 94 overall Levante David. I'm gonna sub him in where Pete Werner is. I'm sorry, Pete Werner. Your reign has been immaculate, but Levante David is better. I also have to assume that Levante David is going to get a free lurk artist, which will actually save us an AP on defense. Free lurk artist. Bingo. All right, that first wheel spin, nothing insane, but we do save one AP on defense. That's actually really, really big. And our second wheel spin is... We recently got this. I think it's actually how we picked up Christian Darisaw. Any single player in the NFL, but they... Oh, it's going to be really young. Yo. They're going to be so... So young, 21. Dude, they just took their first sip of alcohol because everybody knows that nobody breaks that rule. Bro, I came out of the fucking womb with a Mickey Ultra in my hand. I came out of the room double fisting Mickey Ultras. I had a Zinachino, upper decky, lower decky, two Mickeys, and your mom was giving me head. Okay, do you remember how I said we need to get a backup for Jameer Gibbs? So I can't, I can't do that, but I, I can do something else. I'm looking up 21 year old NFL. NFL players. There's honestly like an impressive amount. Anthony Richardson's 21. Keely Ringo's 21. Jordan Addison, Jackson Smith, and Jigba. But I couldn't really use any of those guys. None of those were upgrades for this team. And then I remembered something. Not only is Jameer Gibbs 21 years old, but Jameer Gibbs got a team of the year. 97 overall halfback, which is going to be a massive upgrade to our already, who's already been insane, 95 overall Jameer Gibbs. So it's, it's, it literally is just the exact same card, except plus two ish to every single stat some a little bit more uh 97 speed 96 excel 98 agility it's it's the exact same thing but better right so i i was kind of worried we weren't gonna have a good option here but i'm actually gonna take jameer gibbs and basically pack a punch him to 97 overall jameer gibbs was born march 20th of 2002 oh my god oh my god i got so lucky wait as you're watching this he's 22 oh 
<laughs> Yo, that's crazy. Or is he? I'm trying to do the dates on this. I don't actually know. When are you seeing this? Dude, I, I lucked out. All I can say is that I lucked out. All I could say is this could have gone poorly. The only thing that does suck here is I totally expect him to have zero AP ability. He's got a lot of good abilities, but all of them are one AP, and we don't have the bandwidth on offense, so this Jimmy or Gibbs is just gonna have to go in raw, but if he learned anything from me, it's that it's just fine to go in raw. You can always just, you can always just get rid of it after, right? <laughs> I can't make that. Don't go in raw. Wear a condom. You will end up with every STD in the book. Take it from me, okay? That one you can take from me. All right, 97 Jameer Gibbs. We now have three team of the year players on offense and none on defense. I will say though, Levante David's a 95 and outside linebacker. So he was born to be there. Uh, and we also now have an extra ability of point to use on defense. I guess I could I could rock universal coverage on Derek Stingley. Or sorry, Stonewall. Stonewall on Derek Stingley. Why not? Let's make sure everybody's got ability. We are now a 95 overall team. Thanks to those upgrades with Levante David and Jameer Gibbs. One offense, one defense. I did not expect that upgrade, but I'm really happy to have it. Before we head into the NFC Championship, the only thing left is the challenge wheel, which honestly could just give me another potential prestige player. That's really all we're looking to add. Yeesh! We've got to go off with one player in receiving yards. It could be Jameer Gibbs. I feel like the realistic candidates are Jameer Gibbs, Jamar Chase, Plaxico Burris. Uh, I'll take a I'll take a surprise player if it comes down to it. The All Madden Playoffs AFC Championship. Sorry, I'm so used to saying NFC Championship because I'm a Lions fan. Let's go get this money, boys. Come on. Big Micah Parsons, limited Patrick Mahomes, and then team captain Channing Crowder. That's a solid team. Coach suggested defense has been absolutely killer for me, so we're gonna rock it until I feel like switching it. He's got lighted up Mahomes, so he's gonna have that ability the entire game. No, 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 no. Come on, believe. He's gonna start with a handoff and he's gonna get rocked by Carmichael. Taking on the Minnesota Vikings. This would've been a cool Super Bowl matchup. All right, I'm cool with this. RPO! Luckily, Patrick Sertan's homer. That could have gotten a lot worse. Third and two. I don't think he does this. Sorry, I called that RPO. It's a read option, my bad. I don't think he does it again though. Oh, oh, we love that. Nick Bosa, Jalen Carter. It's fourth and four and he's no huddling. Oh my God. Wait, huge opportunity. He's passing. We're in Tampa two. Get there, get there. No way. And I didn't even get him. Holy shit. I dove over him. Damn it. Nice play. That's a really nice play. I expected a short throw and uh, he took the top off. So you got to respect that. I think he hands his ball off now though. That was so weird. I'm going cover four quarters. I'm going to put Nick Bosa on a light blue. Ray's got a lot of responsibility here. Jalen Carter. You talk shit about the Jalen Carter prestige all you want, man. That's the most ridiculous 93 overall I've ever used. I think he's going to try and do the same thing. Oh, oh, we love that. PS2. PS2 is a fucking animal. I got to look for a corner route. Hit me with it last time out of Bowers. I'm going to let Ray have his zone. There's the corner route. That's it. Oh, we're on that. We're on that. That's a hell of a throw. And this is inside zone. After some shit like that, bring Sean T down. There she is. Come on. That was RPO, wasn't it? Oh, no. He just goes same thing. Good touchdown. I don't know what happened there on defense. That was very bizarre. 10 plays, 75 yards. He needed to make some really big plays, though, to keep that drive alive. I think as we go here, I can turn him over. All right. First and 10. We know this. We know this defense. Oh, I can't make that throw, but Plaxico had him. Plaxico had him cooked. Plaxico's got him again. Plaxico Burris, huge stiff arm. Take third and inches. He takes a good angle so that I can't get that there. Third and inches don't need much here. I'm gonna take Jameer Gibbs. Oh, I was hoping to have blockers downfield. I'm gonna block Gronk. Looking for this post out of uh, Plaxico. Hopefully the user will, will look at Jameer Gibbs and get spooked or something. Honestly, the Red Sea pardon works. I don't know why that is so open. Let's just go Jameer. He's got room. We can make something happen here. Oh, oh, we love that. That's the 97 Jameer. Uh, you know what? I, you know what's funny? I almost said, wow, Jameer feels really fast. All right, seven to zero. Got to punch this in the end zone. He doesn't have inside stuff or no outsiders. Okay, so I can run the ball. Okay, we got to wait a little bit. Yup. Hey. Hey, you guys taught me that one. That was not a good, by the way, that was not a good RPO at all. That shit was bagged. You think Gronk can get his man here? Is he shaded for this? 
I just took the check down. I, I didn't know if there was anything there, so I didn't want to risk it. Second and four, I'm gonna run this again, though, because he took Gronk last time, which means I can hit Plaxico. I can actually go Jameer. Ooh, 97 Jameer! Woo! Ooh, that's spicy. He's not in, though. I'm just gonna hand this off. What? Wait, 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 wait. He had a full speed ahead? Nobody blocked him? Are you kidding? Oh, he's gonna leave Jameer, but oh my god, I'm getting fucking screamed at. I can't get a thing right now. He's gonna leave Gronk, finally! Had to stay hot. Had to stay hot right there. Let's go. The no huddle was the right call. I was nervous. Damn, he got like two fucking screamers on me. But hey, we got him with Gronk. I'm tempted to go for two, but I'm not gonna. Hey, he doesn't have inside stuff. He doesn't have no outsiders. We can absolutely run the ball. That was a really good passing drive, though. I'm glad that I know that's in my arsenal. But we got, we got to go back to the run. It's so much safer. I'm gonna go pass commit. Hopefully get some pass rush here. Dude, we have such good pass rushers. We got to get home on Mahomes here. No corner outs. Love it. I lo Oh, God, he's shaky. How the hell? That was really good move by him. I wanted to I wanted to go for all of it. I wanted the fucking big hit. We are missing all our hit sticks, dude. I need to connect on some of these. He's going no huddle too. He's gonna go with that same run play. This one doesn't go for as much, but he's still getting good yards on that, which I'm surprised. I'm in a, a good set to stop that. He gets a two minute warning here. I get the ball at half. So these, uh, these possessions here are crucial. Do it, fucking do it. Oh, get home, Will Anderson! Second and 27. That's a huge, that's huge. Now I'm gonna guess pass and I'm gonna send Derwin to. Oh, big hit. Hey, PS2 knockout. I love Patrick Sertan. Third and 27, we're bringing out Sam Will Blitz. This is the perfect opportunity for Sam Will Blitz right here. Fourth and 27. I can't imagine you go for this. He does. We just got to get to the quarterback before he can throw this. He's going to block McCaffrey or we get to it. If he doesn't block McCaffrey, we get to him so fast that. Holy shit. He just got so much time on that. Still can't get it off. Sam Will Blitz is the best long yardage pass defense in the game. That's crazy. Let's go. I shouldn't be saying shit like that. I have no idea if that's true. I don't play competitively. But I know that it's 7-7. Seven to seven. We have the ball. And more importantly, we get the ball at half. So I am absolutely in a position to have the lead going into half. And we can run the ball. He doesn't have the abilities to stop this. I'm going to take this. I'm going to take this left side. I think he ran commit there. Still going to get five yards on it. Beautiful. Holy shit, that's fucking textbook. Get the joke, joke. <laughs> I really shouldn't even run that in. I really should kneel that. I should kneel that at the two. Milk all the clock and then score, but whatever. That was disgusting. I love you, 97 Jameer. I don't know if 95 Jameer does that. Look at this double juke. On the safety and the backer. I don't know if 95 Jameer pulls that off. I do know it's 14 to seven. That was stupid. Actually, it was, it was really stupid. You're never guaranteed the touchdown, right? But that was stupid. He had three timeouts and 54 seconds to tie it up. We'll see if that comes back to bite me. Is that a heater? It's not a heater! Sertan's got it! Don't test him! That's our prestige! Patrick Sertan is taking this game over! Oh my god, it's all PS2 right now. That's huge. Wait a minute. Now I'm a genius for scoring that fast because I'm going to score again. All right, easy stretch. He just fucking ran commit on that. See ya! <laughs> I scored too quick again. In a span of 12 seconds, I put up 14 points. I, I actually did. I literally just did it again. Whatever. Jameer Gibbs is going off. I'm not stopping that, man. I don't know about my, um... I don't know about my 175 yards, though. Yeah, so that was stupid because I definitely could have gone in with a two-possession lead, and now he has an opportunity to score. But he also... Didn't have much hope. All right, he'll get a little, little nine yards there and get out of bounds. A nice play. The thing is, we can guess pass every time and just go for some solid pass rush. I'm going to let the D-line do their thing. We get a sack, and we really make this difficult for him. Ooh, Derwin was acting like he had that. He, if he had caught that ball in stride, though, his wide receiver is a touchdown. So he got a uh, tight end corner round. Yep, 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 Bag. No way. Dude, no way. Fourth and inches. You turn this ball over, I'm going to score again. Oh, my God. We're actually here. There's no way, right? He's got to run this. Get him out of here! Come on! <laughs> oh my god.
god. Dude, that was such a good game. And it crumbled in a split second. Holy shit. I was down seven to zero. I put up 21 unanswered in about 30 seconds. And I was about to put up 28. Oh my god. That is so crazy. Don't you ever talk shit about Jalen Carter? All right, so we don't get our challenge wheel. We absolutely earned the rage quit wheel on this one, though. I didn't take it before. Whatever. I'm taking it on this one. That was a... Dude, I, th I thought this was going to be a good game. I was sweating. When it was 7-0, is that a 93 choice? Our choice of a 93 overall player. Gosh, I cannot believe this team is so good that I can't think of who that's going to be. Oh, uh, can't be fullback. Can't be wide receiver. Can't be anything O-line. Technically, it could be a right tackle, but Darisaw is also technically a 94. He's just out of position. Uh, D-tackle 2. Yeah, let's pick up a D-tackle 2 instead of 87 Geno Atkins. I mean, we, we see how good 93 Jalen Carter is, right? We're headed to the Super Bowl, boys. We officially have a new prestige player. We've earned it. Well, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Rather than taking a D tackle here, I could get a prestige option. No, I feel like we got a dude. We got a prestige Patrick Sertan. He earned it, bro. He has been so good. Let's give it. Let's give the prestige to Sertan most likely. And then let's also uh, just pick up a 93 D tackle. I'm taking Sheldon Rankins. Oh my God. He is fast. 88 speed, 88 excel, 94 block shed, 94. Wow. This is a nasty 93 overall. He also has like times two Texans. I almost could like put Texans come on and actually use it. Will Anderson, Derek Stingley, Sheldon Rankins. Do I have anybody else? Sorry, Gino Atkins. You've officially been replaced on both sides of the ball. Gentlemen, this has been, <laughs> this has been a crazy season. All that's left is the Super Bowl. I'm going to hold off on recording the Super Bowl because I don't want to guarantee this PS2 prestige. I feel like if I wait, like uh, right now I'm like two weeks ahead on Wheel of Mutt. So if I wait two weeks, there's a chance that like, I don't know, maybe Carmichael gets an insane ultimate legend. Maybe Devin Witherspoon gets an insane card. Who knows? Who knows who's going to get what cards? So I'm going to wait, but I know for a fact that PS2 is an excellent, excellent, excellent team of the year prestige option. This 96 pretty much just took that game over. He's only going to be better. All right, boys. I love you guys. Hell of a wheel of mutt. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.